This video is here to teach you how to use our app. To begin using the app, you will need to go to settings to set a monthly budget. This monthly budget will be recorded by the app, and the app will use it to calculate how much money you have remaining to spend that month. Let's use $50 as an example for the monthly limit. You can see here that you also have an option of using six categories to record your spendings in. For the demonstration, let's use the examples of food, events, and clothes. Once you click save, you can start using the app. The app displays how much money you have remaining for the month and how much money you have already spent. Let's add some expenses. Over here, you can choose the date that you spent money on. Here, you enter the amount. As you can see here, so far, this amount has remained green because it is within the monthly limit. Let's say I spent another $50 so far this month. As you can see, this number has turned red to indicate that I've gone over my monthly limit. Let's click on view spending and see what we have here. This screen will allow you to view all of your previous logged expenses. There are four filters that you can use, by date, by month, by category, and view all. So I've gone ahead and added a few more expenses, and this way you can see all of the money I spent in April. At the bottom, the app calculates for you the total that you spent that month. You can also use by category, and in conjunction with the filter for April 2016, I can see all of the food that I've purchased in the month of April. Of course, if I clear filters, I can also view all of the money I've spent in food in all of the months, not just including April. The last filter is view all, and this displays for you every single expense that you've logged. And again, it displays for you this total sum at the bottom of the screen. The last button on the home page is the help button. This screen will be here to help you in case you ever forget how to use any of the functions. We hope that Piggy Bank is an app that you will be able to use to help you remain fiscally responsible. Thank you for watching.